Hello, this is Sandra Brown of Happiness Past 60. Well, we're going to small groups tonight and I decided to make German chocolate cupcakes because I found a good icing recipe. Well, I can't find the icing recipe, so I gotta find something else. And I'm not used to this oven in the house that we moved in. And it's got a confectioner's thing on it. I, look what happened with these cupcakes, how weird. Look at these. Well, first of all, my mistake was I started filling the cups and like there was too much batter. Then I grabbed the box and it said it makes 24 cupcakes. Oh gosh, that's twice as much batter as I have. Then I grabbed this little one to put the rest in. <laughs> well, I don't know. You know, icing covers a lot of mistakes. But what is this thing where it's like, like the inside's coming out? Well, first I preheated it on a regular, like 350. And then before I put it in, I put it on con convection 350. Then I, re I looked, I asked Alexa about it to confectioner's oven and she said 325 for cupcakes. Then I turned it down. So I got some weird cupcakes. I'm like, should I take these things tonight? Well, we'll see. I'll put the icing on it. Because, I mean, the taste was going to be fine. I tasted the batter, and it was delicious. Okay, I'll let you know. Now for just a fine day German chocolate icing recipe. I had one before. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, so I cut off all the little excess pieces that were staying. <laughs> I know it's bad now, but I'm hoping that once I get the icing on, it will be okay. This is what I cut off. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to make the ice and see what happens. This is what you'll need for German chocolate coconut pecan icing. Oh, delicious. I'm going to use a medium pan and a wooden spoon that Susan Ford sent me. <laughs> Thank you, Susan. And uh, one teaspoon of vanilla. One cup of evaporated milk one and one third cup of shredded coconut, one cup of brown sugar, three egg yolks, one cup of chopped pecans, and one stick of butter. All of this is gonna go in the kettle. And I'm supposed to, I haven't made it this way before, I'm supposed to cook it I think it till I'll get back with you till it's kind of brown. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, now I'm stirring this on a low boil for about 10 minutes. And I'm using my timer. Stirring it constantly. And this cooking up brings it to a nice caramel color. Okay, it's through cooking, 10 minutes. It's caramel color, and the aroma is incredible. Well, let's... Cupcakes are done, and they're frosted. And might I add, um, delicious. <laughs> and you can't tell, see, frosting covers up a multitude of sins. <laughs> Next time I'm gonna read the package makes 24 cupcakes, not 12 like I had. <laughs> okay, folks, that you might enjoy this, but the frosting recipe is so good. Very, very easy. Bye-bye now.